Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and if you're new here then welcome. If you've clicked on this video, obviously you've seen what we're doing. I'm going to be trying to eat like Taylor Swift for the day for 24 hours. I've been a big fan of Taylor Swift since I was maybe 12 and I'm now 23 so I've gone through all the eras and obviously right now she's got me, you need to calm down, absolute bops. You know, Taylor's got her life together. I think I'm going to try and eat like her and just see where this goes. There are various articles online talking about what she eats so we're going to follow one of them today. I'm doing this with my friend Ruth, I'll introduce you to her in a minute but she starts for breakfast with buckwheat crepes with ham and cheese and a fried egg on top um so immediately there's a couple issues here firstly um i am vegetarian so <coughs> no ham second i don't know where to acquire buckwheat from so that's an issue third i also don't tolerate egg <coughs> very well and fourth I'm kind of lazy so it wasn't off to a good start but then I went to Greenwich Market the other week which is kind of near where I live and they were doing a vegan buckwheat crepe stand which has basically the same thing as what she has so we're gonna go there for breakfast it doesn't open till 10 but Taylor also likes to start her day with a skinny vanilla latte so we're gonna get that first before breakfast like a pre-breakfast and I never normally drink coffee that's gonna be weird so we're gonna start with that and then also in the article she says she drinks like 10 bottles of water a day so we're gonna try that i feel like maybe she's exaggerating but we're just gonna take it as is if that's true taylor you need to calm down so yeah we're gonna be doing taylor food all day long hope you enjoy it give it a thumbs up if you do and let's start with bottle number one and see how that tally goes bottle number one of ten it's gonna be a long day this is Ruth who's accompanying me on this challenge day. Hi. Ruth is my... Do you feel awkward just sitting there? <laughs> <laughs> Ruth is my best friend from childhood. Yeah. We've known each other since we were four, five. Yeah. Go get our coffee. Neither of us drink coffee. Yeah, it's really interesting. We're both kind of hyper anyway, so... <laughs> Off for a coffee. Who knows what's gonna happen? Yeah, you know. First bottle's down. I don't nine more to do. I don't want to do nine more. I'm already gonna. I pee a lot as it is. Time for bottle number two. Five liters of water. We're gonna die. Stop number one. Drink acquired. Okay, so I've gone for Taylor's drink of a skinny vanilla latte. I got it iced because it's actually really hot today. I've got an iced chai latte with vanilla. <laughs> I did. I the split second they asked for my name and I was like Emily, but then I was like I should have said Taylor. So then Ruth. I did it. There we go. Taylor. My new identity for the day. <laughs> oh. Time for a taste test. Cheers. So good. This is concerning. Emily's developed a liking for coffee. I've never liked coffee until the past few weeks. The other week, if you don't follow me, I have an obsession with Waitress and I went to see it like two nights in a row. And I was so tired that I started drinking coffee in the morning. I've never needed coffee. And I'm starting to really like it. That's bad. That yeah. Vanilla is really good. Taylor, good job. I can see why you like it. We're gonna hang out here and drink these by the Cutty Sark. The Sark. And then go for breakfast at the market when it opens in half an hour. Half an hour. See you then actually really good we're also double liquiding while we're here we've got coffee and we're also on i'm on bottle number two of the water and to be honest i'm getting full from liquid and now it is breakfast time crepes angolettes gluten-free buckwheat all the things we need What can a bench do? We have acquired breakfast, buckwheat crepes, as Taylor has. Mine has vegan cashew cheese, mushrooms, walnuts, sundry tomatoes, and various herbs and stuff. Mine has normal cheese, goat's cheese, spinach, walnuts, and honey. So this, this is just solid cheese. Let's just see how lush it looks. It was almost so lush. Like, she was like, oh, do you want to add this and this? And I was like, sure. Like, like spices, chili. I was like, yeah. go for it. Put all the herbs, all the spices. So we're going to have a taste test. See what it's, it's 10 a.m. I'm very hungry. Yeah, right. Mm. Oh my God, that goat's cheese. That was really good. I rate this. So we're going to have these. Oh. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna have these. I didn't expect it to be that cheesy. No, that was a pool. We're gonna have these. Finish off a second bottle of water for me. Probably pee. Definitely pee. We're gonna enjoy this food. Good job, Taylor. Cute and free as well. Oh, yeah. Update. We are almost finished with the crates and 
But all the materials down. Well, a drink left. I'm going to I'm going to fill that up at Starbucks, pee, and then move on. But crepes are really, really good. <laughs> She's very content. I'm hungry. <laughs> Your mission, dispose of the trash in the trash can. Can you do it? One, two, three. Oh. <laughs> How the mighty have fallen. Right, I'm going to give it a go. I can't look at the camera at the same time. I'll stick to vlogging. <laughs> stick to vlogging. <laughs> Water bottle number three acquired. I'm going strong and I really, really, really need to pee. Also, I'm not condoning the use of like plastic straws and plastic cups, but I don't have a reusable one yet. I will. Recycle kids. Good. And I'm reusing this bottle because I had to buy it when I was on the go and I needed a bottle a few days ago. So please don't come for me in the comments about that. This is a tailor approved street if I ever saw one. Shay never made anyone less gay. Quick into the time, we're three and a half bottles down and we've come to Western Live, which is a free oh, music right. fest musical festival in London. Fun. Would recommend. We came yesterday. Uh, we're just gonna get to the side where the screens are because the line goes back like a few miles. So I'm gonna do that and check back in with you when we eat some more food. Because you know Taylor's like a cultured gal, right? Yeah, she definitely goes to the pub. She likes the theatre <laughs> in London. Yeah. <laughs> Pre-made ones because I feel like going to the 
go during and tell her about some by weight that's dangerous. We'll so we're just checking these out. Um gonna get one of those because I feel like she probably goes to Whole Foods a lot. It's a New Yorky kind of thing. So I'm feeling it's a teriyaki tofu salad. So I feel like I'm gonna get that. I think I'm gonna go for a quinoa salad. It's a little quinoa. hot. I might not for a roll. I feel like this quite, is a good vibe. That's a good vibe. I feel like this is good, but not enough food for lunch. And Taylor has tour rehearsals and stuff, so you need the cops. Finally, lunch time for tea and chips because Animal. I feel like Taylor's the kind of gal that likes tea likes and chips. She does. I'm intrigued by these. They look more like dried butter. Mm. I don't know exactly what's in this. Rice, tofu, and a mummy bean. It's lush. I feel like this is a Taylor kind of meal. She would like this. Cheers. <laughs> Let's eat. Bye. So Amanda, Amanda met us at West End Live. This isn't related to Taylor, but Whole Foods. Three pound for that tart. And is it good? Yes. With the glaze on it. She made sure to get a specific one. I pointed it out. Yep. So that is what's going down right now. For once, this isn't a Disney vlog, but there's still some quality Disney content to be had. I would like to see it. <laughs> what a to the day. Now Ruth's gonna have to leave me here yeah. to go home. I still get it to go. This I will not be happy. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, I look a mess. Hey everyone, so I just got home. It's around six o'clock and I'm on bottle number six. Um, I just added a bit of squash, which is in the UK, it's like flavoring. Um, it's not syrup, but it basically just adds something because I'm really struggling with the water. My stomach feels full. Like it kind of almost hurts from all the water. Um, yeah, I'm really not hungry right now. Normally I would eat dinner around this time, but we didn't have lunch till like three. We had the cookie as a snack at like half 12. So I'm gonna try and chug my way through another one of these, but I don't wanna have too much water and not be able to have dinner. So yeah, I mean her dinner basically from what I gathered is like she often has chicken and then various vegetables. She mentioned asparagus and one into I think. So I've got, as I'm vegetarian, I have these like mock chicken um, burgers. So that's what I'm gonna have with various vegetables on the side, but I'll update you when I've actually got that because right now I just want to flop and watch some YouTube but I'll check back in with you when that happens. I don't know how I'm going to have another 7, 8, 9, 10, 4 and this. The rest of the day has been great but the 10 bottles of water thing is a little bit much. A little bit much Taylor. You need to calm down. Oh there. Yeah, I'll check back in with you soon. Seven. So it's now 7.45 and I'm just having dinner. 7.45, just having dinner, which is very late for me. But honestly, that water was making me feel so full. Here we have it. Um, I'm gonna flip this around because you wanna see the food, not me. So I just did one of the chicken burgers because honestly, I'm not that hungry. Asparagus, tomatoes, peppers, and some salad. I'm going to enjoy this. I feel like I'm probably gonna start eating and then get really hungry and wish I had two of the burgers like I originally planned. But that's life. Um, I'm gonna continue with the water. This is bottle number seven, I think. Well, have I had seven? I don't know. I'll go through the footage. Um, yeah. Let's eat. <laughs> Do you care me reacting to this? I don't know. One sec. You're balancing on my sofa right now. 
which is fine because most nights I literally do eat dinner on my sofa. <gasps> Let's just do this. It's not as fancy as Taylor's, obviously. There's that chicken and a tomato. Bone apple teat. Mm hmm. Okay, I'm gonna enjoy this and check back in with you when I. Shush! Check back in with you when I am um, further through this. Yep. And that is the end of bottle number eight. And I am tapping out of this because that's four liters plus the coffee. And I also had like a little drink this morning before I filled up the bottle. So I don't wanna be peeing all night basically. That is the end of this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Comment down below if you want me to do a different celebrity. I'd be very open to doing that. Um, Cause this is kind of fun, especially because like I love Taylor Swift. I would be open to pretty much anyone though because I like food. Be sure to subscribe down below for more videos. I don't normally do stuff like this, but I'm open to doing random stuff, to be honest. Um, I just like vlogging and eating and yeah. I hope you enjoyed the little musical interludes as well. I know it's kind of random. Um, but I hope to see you in the next video and have a magical rest of your day. I normally end this with some kind of like Disney thing, but it's not. Hope you're feeling 22, even though Taylor's like, Almost 30 now. Okay, see you next time. Bye. Whiskey for ice, sunset.